After a surprising upset loss to the St. Thomas Cardinals earlier in the season, the Legionnaires have seemingly kicked into high gear, winning seven in a row and sitting in first place in the Thames Valley Senior Fastball League with an impressive 10-1 record. The Oak Ridge Reds also got off to a hot start this summer, but they knew they were in for a challenge coming into their first contest against Listowel. Despite playing the role of the underdog, the Reds players knew that if the Legionnaires saw them as an easy win, they'd be in for a rude awakening. Well, Oak Ridge Reds, uh, not a bad team, but when we have our full team here, which we didn't have the last time we played them, they'll be, end up being the same as the other teams that we play. Our team's that much stronger. Well, Listel's a great team. We uh, knew coming out here that they were going to play us hard, so we just came out here hoping to hit the ball, and uh, the first couple innings got a couple on them and played solid defense. Not many errors throughout the game, and it was just all-around good game. Yeah, we like to play a lot of little ball, bunt, set first and second, and uh, just move the base runners around. Well, it was, we, we got a rally going where, you know, the guys ahead of me got, uh, got some things going. Um, you know, Benoza put a great bunt down to load the bases and just looking for a good pitch to hit, and we got it, so. About the third my my life, so, oh well. <laughs> it's never safe, but, you know, we felt pretty confident. We played well, and we didn't, you know, make too many errors out there, and it was all good, so. Both of our pitchers had a great one. Kevin Lunter, for the first uh, six innings, only gave up three runs, and, uh, Held them to probably about six hits, I'd say. It was just, he pitched a great game. Then Ben came in to close it off, and uh, he was throwing hard, and uh, they weren't keeping up with him, really. Overall, I was just, I was just trying to stay around the zone because we had, uh, you know, a six-run lead. And uh, at that point, just, you know, try to let them get get themselves out, let our guys do the jobs, and, you know, that's what happened. So it was good. That was a big at-bat because, or I think earlier, I think it was that at-bat, he hit a, hit a foul ball that was about 400 feet, and it, uh, you know, Kind of rattled it up a little bit. Really realized it was it could have been a close game at that point, so just kind of had to bear down, and put some good pitches on. I ended up striking him out, so it uh, got him on a good pitch, so it looked out good. We were due for a loss. You get too you get too overconfident, and then bang, it comes it comes like that. When you win seven or eight in a row, then they don't think they have to play the game anymore to to win. They need a wake up call. They just had it, and uh, this won't knock us out of first place by any means. We're not worried about that. Um, win the next five games and. There's no problems. It's a huge win. Huge win on their field. Uh, it's a tough field to come to. And uh, we played great out here, and so did they, and it was a huge win for us.